Peace, peace. Um, yeah, I was checking out our brother Death of the Cloud Chaser. And it was like someone else, another um, podcast brother. Uh, and he was talking about the um, the offset situation. Offset was arrested at a gas station. Hey, man, we got offset in the news. This happened um, around the time when Cardi B first had, had the baby. So it's a little bit old in news. But at the same time, the reason that um, I'm bringing it up is because in this situation, right, I want to ask you a question. Is Offset, you know what I'm saying, being a snitch right here, you know what I'm saying? Is Peace, peace. Uh, yeah, I was checking out our uh, brother Death of the Cloud Chaser. Uh, and it's like someone else, another uh, podcast brother. Uh, and he was talking about uh, um, the offset situation. Offset was arrested at a gas station. And the police found, um, they found three loaded guns. They found three loaded guns in the car. They arrested him, but you can hear while they arrested him, um, he's saying those are his though, actually telling the cops, those are not my guns, those are my friend's guns. We switched, you know, I guess uh, uh, Offset got in the driver's seat, the other brother got in, in the passenger seat. But anyway, he's telling the cops that these are his guns and they're not mine. Some people are saying that the brother's allegedly snitching. This is definitely telling. This is definitely telling. Now, his man didn't seem really too angry. So maybe it was some type of agreement. I was reading the comments, uh, Def of the, uh, Brother Death of the Cloud Chaser's comment section, and one person said, you have to remember Bootsy, and someone else um, said that these rappers have four guys that take the blame for them. I believe that people in the street have it. You know what I'm saying? You're getting a certain amount of money, and certain people will do anything to be around you or just to be a part of the camp. So I could kind of believe that, that these brothers have four guys that will take the weight for them. Um, these, um, I think what Biggie's man did it, right? Biggie's man did it. Uh, someone did it for Jay-Z. Uh, did someone do it for Nas? I can't remember. Uh, but this goes on all the time. But I think the main thing was people, some people saying that Offset was snitching some people say that he wasn't. You're always going to have that split division. Me, myself, um, I don't know him to be a snitch or testifying against anyone, getting anyone arrested. Uh, but this was definitely telling. I don't know if his his man agreed with it. Maybe this was planned. Yo, if, yo police stop you, man. Just say it's mine. Maybe it's one of those situations. I don't know. Um you know, maybe, but you know, I'm pretty sure some people are going to go around and put the snitch label. Yo, dude's a snitch. Yo, be careful. But maybe him and this man has some type of agreement. You know what I'm saying? Because his man didn't, you know, be like, oh, you know what? Those are not mine. You know what I mean? His man sounded like, yo, those are mine. So maybe it's some type of agreement they have. Uh, someone else mentioned the whole Jim Jones thing. Uh, I know in the papers it said when Jim Jones was stopped. Uh, he told the cop, hey, I told my friend to stop, um, but they're high and they kept going, blah, blah, blah. That's a form of dry snitching. The police come, you don't say nothing. You all go down to the precinct and you talk. I mean, you go down to the precinct, get booked, whatever. You speak to your lawyer that's going to defend you. But as far as saying, yo, I told my friend to slow down. Come on, what's that? You're, like, you're trying to put the blame on your friend saying if you was driving, you would have slowed down for the cop. 
you know, I mean, you know, so um, the whole thing with the offset thing, um, if, if his man is cool with it, then um, I don't see other people um, making a 